A friend of mine introduced me to Hensel Phelps. He was an intern, we were in college together. He was a fellow Marine. Said Hensel Phelps was a great place to work for veterans, very veteran friendly, supported us, supported our needs, and uh, suggested I go intern. My dad was a carpenter, and so I grew up around construction my entire life. And when I got out of the military, it seemed like it was natural for me to jump into the construction industry. So first thing I did was talk to a friend who owned a deck building company and asked him for a job. And that's how it started. I joined the Marine Corps out of, right out of high school at 17, trying to get out of a small town. Ended up in the Army. I did that in 2004. I got out in 2020, four days before I started here. The next semester rolled around, I walked into the Southwest District Office, tried to sign up for an interview for an intern, Steve Grauer, the VP, seen me, offered me an interview, and then the rest is history. Uh, my training in the military made construction a natural fit for me. I started out as an architecture major and then decided that I wanted to be more hands-on in the building process. So I decided to go to school for construction management at Cal Poly, got my degree, and that's what brings me here as a super. I was invited to a, a job fair and all I could think was it's free barbecue I'm 30 minutes outside of Nashville you're crazy if you don't go for free barbecue at the end of it he said well I'm here recruiting let me have your resume because I think we have a project for you in Round Rock I went from being completely panicked because I didn't know what I was going to do I joined the military at 17 I'd spent 16 years like my entire adult life and then some in the military and it was coming to an end and huge weight came off my shoulders and I knew I was going home so I took it and I've loved every minute since. So when, when I got out from the military and transitioning to civilian life, a military recruiter in LinkedIn actually messaged me and you know I just like I just replied back. I said, like, you know, what, what do you have in store for me? During the interview process, um, they decided because of my background, I'll, be, I'll fit best in the VDC department. Even then, I have no idea what VDC department is. Uh, apparently, it's kind of like the best in both world because I do have my design background, I have the technology background, and also I want to, uh, to be more in the management. So that's, that's how I get to know Hustle Phelps. Uh, my experience in the military uh, and my career as a logistician uh, helps me understand the construction industry and all its complexities. Uh, in the military, uh, we had to plan and execute the movement of personnel and equipment through time and space. Uh, in the construction industry, it's the same. We have personnel flow, crew management across the project through different phases, as well as making sure we have materials show up on site, on time, and at the right time. My military experience taught me you know, early mornings, long nights. We got a mission we got to achieve and we have a deadline to do it by. Get it done and then you can take a break. And I think bringing that with me to Hensel Phelps, that, that's gone a long way for me. My career in the military helped shape my career in construction by instilling discipline, integrity, and honor everything that I do. Consistent training to make sure that I execute successfully. My career in the military helped me really become a better leader um, and that transitions to any, any industry um, especially being in the Marine Corps the Marine Corps is all about small unit leadership you could be 19 20 years old leading a team of four or five 20 men right it just gives you the confidence to make decisions be confident in your decisions and and move on